Okay, so today we're going to be talking about why I got a V6 Challenger instead of a V8 Hemi. So, you got to think about it how, like, the way, like, your, how, like, how long you want it, the payments are, um, how much are going to be your payments. My payments are not bad. I mean, I love my payments. Um, I bought, I bought this car when I had my old job, but now I have a new job. I'm making a little bit more. So, paying it off is probably going to be sooner as possible. I'm going to try maybe next year. So, that's one thing good about buying a V6 just for a start. Like, just, if you're just starting off, buying, like, your first car. This is, like, legit, like, my very first car. So, that's another real big thing, too. If it's going to be your first car, don't go, I mean, unless you really want to, don't go too crazy. Like, if you go crazy, you buy, like, a brand new, so say if I want a scat pack, you buy, like, how much How much those go for? Like, 45000 41000 I think, around there. I mean, mine was only twenty five used. It only had 20,000 miles on it. Um, I'm behind on one thing. I'm behind this Mustang. That's one hella slow Mustang. Come on, man. I'm, actually, I'm on my way to get haircut. But um, you got to think about the price and how long it's going to take you to pay it, pay it off. That's one th good thing. If you can pay it off as soon as possible, that's what. That's how I've always been raised. Try to pay things off as soon as possible. When you have the money, do it. So, when, so if I ever want to, well, once I'm done paying this off, just trade it in. Maybe I'm thinking about a scat, but later on in the future, I'm digging the scat white bodies though. The scat pack white bodies are pretty clean. So that's one thing. Just uh, make sure. You know what you're getting, you're getting yourself into, even if it, even if it's like your very first car. Second, I mean, the gas is good. It, I think gas is like three twenty, three forty in my time right now. And like that's like an easy like a, let's say, sorry, this guy doesn't know how to drive. Um, so like, I say about like 45 to fill it up, 45, 50. I mean, I could do that. Well, I don't drive this car around a lot, lot as much as I did. So I'm not really putting that much gas into it or I'm hardly even driving it. Um, so I mean, gas is good. You save gas. I guess you can do a little, little bit more, but I think on the RTs, and the regular SXTs, I think you're only saving like four miles. Like, or no, you're losing like four miles for the Hemi. And you're gaining four for the six. I mean, if you think of it like in numbers, I guess that's a big number for you. But like, now that I see it now in my head, I'm like, it's not that bad, to be honest. I mean... For sure, next car I'm gonna get is easily gonna be um, a Hemi or some something eight. Only Challengers or Chargers. I don't fuck with um, Mustangs, Camaros. I don't know. They're kind of too tight. But um, yeah. So and then also think about it too. Is like, are you gonna daily drive it every day? Like I know a person that has a Hellcat. And she daily drives that every day. That, that's a lot of money, to be honest. That's a lot of money in gas for a daily. Um, like I said, it, only, it honestly comes down to like, I mean, and also if you do have like the RT name, like Hemi or RT, you kind of do have like that, that OG type. Because back then, like, People like love the Hemis and people know what Hemis are. People know what an RT is. And um also you do gain you do gain that I would say like not power, but like um pe people notice. And then um 
it honestly comes down to like what you really want to spend I think um I mean f I bought my challenger for uh when I was 21 I bought it for when I was 21 I'm gonna be 23 like in like I think eight days 23 in eight days and then my goal is to pay it off this December so that's like my goal and like I said I was raised to pay things off fast possible but that's just me I like getting my things done out of the way so I'm not trying to make this video long it's only like 5 minutes and 50 seconds but um yeah, it comes down to what you really want. First car, I say maybe a six, if you want. First car, a six, and then really learn how to drive it, learn how it is, because jumping into the Challenger, there's hella blind spots. Like, there's a blind spot back here, both sides, even in front of the hood. It's just like, it's just a long super hood, and you can't see, like, at all. I mean, you can see straight, but you can't see down. But, um, yeah. Honestly, like, I say if you're, like, a first-time buyer for a 6. I mean, if, yeah, if you're a first-time buyer, I say a 6. It's not gonna hurt. People, people are gonna be like, oh, why don't you have the Hemi? You can't, you can't afford an RT. I'm all like, uh, nah, man. I'm just, like, I'm just cool with this right now. I gotta, I'm saving up, actually. But, um, yeah. So, it's kind of like a do or do. I mean, as long as the car makes you happy. If it makes you happy, you have something to take care of. I take care of this every day. It's dirty right now because I haven't washed it in, like, a while. Maybe, like, four days. Like, I try to wash it once a week. But it does keep me busy. I love my car. It takes care of me. Um, I treat it the best. I treat it the best I can. Some stuff has happened that wasn't my fault, but what can you do? That's life. Um, I feel like I'm saying um way too too much. So yeah, hopefully this video kind of helped you out a little bit. Like, it, it comes down to you. Like, don't let no one pressure you to spend more money. Focus on like what. Focus on yourself. You know. Focus on yourself. And like what's good for you at that time because I mean if you're not if you're not ready for a V8 expensive car payments insurance then that's gonna come to you like really like really really harsh and rash like payment wise that's why I always always think ahead and above that's a that's a good thing that's how I've always been raised and I'm thankful for that so yeah all right so those are just like little things why i got a six um i want you guys to count how many times i said um because i feel like i said it a lot so yeah okay um see there there goes again it just a habit hopefully this video kind of helped you out a little bit just kind of talk a little bit just the differences i think and then um there goes another um i'll catch you guys for another video soon uh, I'm gonna think of a couple topics. I kind of want to do skits. I'm thinking of skits, but um, I need people. I need friends to do skits. I mean, I have friends, but I don't think none of them want to do skits really. So I'll see you guys next time. Deuces. Bye.